Right there's Ryuk. People seem to enjoy watching our leisurely stroll the other day. That's what we're doing right now. We're uh, walking around the lake and golf course. Just letting them walk around, sniff, and enjoy the sights. Day. I don't care where he goes as long as he keeps the leash loose. If he uh, tightens up the leash, I'll give him a couple clicks and a little tug just to remind him. And we just let him walk around as long as. Uh, Get the leash loose, he can do what he wants on these leisure strolls. Hiawatha Golf Course and uh, Lake Hiawatha. Over here. I'll show you on these trees here that uh, Ryuk was just marking. You see how it's a different color up to about there? It's uh, stains from uh, every dog walking by it and peeing at it over the year. Every tree you'll see along the path is like that. It's kind of funny. So that's the stuff for him to smell because a lot of people walk their dogs here. But, uh, you know, seeing them walk along like this with me with uh, all the cars and people and distractions around give you a little idea of how he's doing. He's doing good. I'm going through this whole uh, training process again after I'm getting, you know, acclimated for a couple of months back uh, into the routine here. Uh, we'll... Uh, Slowly progress back to the off leash stuff we were doing with them. You know, that'll be uh, starting with a long line and then going from there. coming up here, let me move out the trail the side way. Where? Good boy. He sees the squirrel in the tree there. You can see he's not uh, going crazy, even though the squirrel's right there. Is the squirrel caught on the fence? I don't know. No, he's not. Good. But you can see he, uh, didn't get all crazy and start tugging at the leaves there with that squirrel right there. He's got a very high prey drive, but uh, he listens very well despite that in those situations. And I've shown that before in his, uh, in his early off-leash videos. I do formal leash training with him too. I have videos of him doing that when he was younger and I still do it now, but you know, on a three and a half uh, 
mile walk. Uh, we just want them to be kind of leisurely. One second, my sciatic is acting up. Well, Ryu Quinpati, I had to pick that up. We disposed of that in the bucket over there. Hard to film and carry a, a bag of pet waste at the same time. And uh, pulled onto a leash as well. So now that we've disposed of the bag of pet waste, uh, I can get back to filming. Again, uh, this is Lake Hiawatha we're walking around. ignores me for a second. Do I have to do that more than once? I just turn around and I start walking the other way. I'll walk the other way, the other way, and then I'll turn around again and go this way. This teaches him that uh, pulling doesn't get him to where he wants to go sooner. actually illegal for you to have a dog in the city lakes here. I believe the audience is a PB 214. They know that because I'm a former animal warden. Dogs can't be in the local lakes or ice rinks uh, according to that ordinance. They can be in the local creeks, streams, and rivers though. It's not the lakes. Again, on these leisurely walks, he's allowed to just walk around and sniff what he wants as long as he keeps the, the lead loose. Let's see here. Sadic is acting up. I gotta pause every once in a while because of that. It's looking good, 80 out of him there he's hot we've got the lake right here I wish I could let him in the lake I can't but coming just up here is the uh, Minnehaha Creek and uh, we'll let him go in there for cooling off yeah let me fix your collar there we go see the yellow on his ear that's some uh, flower pollen we walked through some flowers earlier in that walk before I started filming Again, uh, I do this with him daily. Uh, you know, uh, I, I thought people would get bored watching me just walk with him on a leash uh, through various areas, but uh, you see, he's a very good boy. And you can tell we do this a lot because he's pretty relaxed.
supposed to get up to uh, 100 today. That was about that hot yesterday too, and it's supposed to be uh, pretty warm tomorrow as well. I'm gonna pause it here, and uh, we get up to the creek, and I let him get some uh, uh, cooling water. I'll resume. We're on a bridge right now, going over the Mihaha Creek. Right there is Lake Hiawatha. Yep. That surprise you? <laughs> Again, the bikes come around that corner pretty quick there. Good boy. Oh, look at this. You see this here? That is a blue heron. See him? Those things are so cool. We'll be hunting frogs and fish. Oh, I should have got a bike coming. Come here. A little better when they're not coming up from behind, huh? <laughs> you see, he does pretty good. I mean, for being what he is, a high content, and deals with new things like that uh, pretty well. This way. Hey, come here. Let me fix your leash. Ugh, there we go. He's under your neck. Hey, we gotta fix it again. Yeah, there we go. Come on. for me to relieve my sciatica. It's been acting up a lot lately. How many dogs do you think pee on that every day, Ryuk? You could probably tell me. <laughs> Alright, come on. Here. I used to play back here when I was a kid. Make like forts out of branches and stuff. Come on. Looking at some monarch butterflies flying around back here. So yeah, in this area here, I used to play when I was a kid. I used to make little BMX tracks back here and around through the trees and uh, teepees out of fallen wood. And 
stuff kids used to do before there were computers and video games. Right, Reeve? Sampling the greenery. golf course through the trees here he's listening to. We're in the back part of Hiawatha Golf Course right now. Just about to come up to the Minnehaha Parkway. This is the Minnehaha Parkway there. Right across the parkway is the, the Lake Nokomis Park House. It's a little bike obstacle course. Nicomas uh, Park House over there. And uh, on the back side of that, you might be able to see it through the trees, is uh, Lake Nicomas. We're walking around Lake Hiawatha right now. Sometimes I walk around both lakes. It ends up being a pretty long walk, especially if I uh, include the lagoon part of uh, Lake Nicomas. trip of the walk is uh, pretty boring. Uh, we get to some more interesting scenery. I'll start filming again. Licking your leg. <laughs> if you've made it along this far, like, subscribe, and share. Hit that notification bell down below. Get email notifications when our new videos come out. You know, thumbing up our video and commenting really helps a lot. Subscribing helps even more. <laughs> I just uploaded a whole bunch of new merch to the merch store. Uh, there's even some new merch that wasn't in the new video I posted yesterday that I created and uploaded after that. So check out the link. I got some of the new merch in the uh, tray below the video, but uh, there's so much more on the website at the link. We'll be back. See ya. I'm here at the uh, Mihaha Creek with Ryuk. I'm up on a dock 
He's down by the creek, cooling off a little bit. See how nice and clear the uh, creek is. Chihuahuas. Let me fix your cow your leash. There we go. Really my sciatica for a second. Reeks like I want to go make fun with some friends with the little dogs. <laughs> Taking a breather and let him cool off a little bit in the creek. He can't go in the uh, lakes because of the local ordinance that prevents dogs from going in the city lakes. But uh, you can go in the. Oh, let me get that back around your head. Come here. There. There we go. You can't go in the local creeks and river and stuff. kids in the background there. There's a baseball field right on the other side of the creek there and some kids playing on the field I guess. At least I hope that's what all that screaming is playing. <laughs> but yeah, I'll probably stop filming here. Uh, we still got about a mile to go before we get back to my Jeep. But again, this is what I do with Reeve daily. Some of the walks are longer and some of them are shorter, but uh, yeah, this is what he does until he uh, gets back in the swing of doing the off-leash stuff with us. That's all. Like, subscribe, and share. Again, check out our new merch store. We got a lot of cool new merch. Buy from Mr. Ryuk, myself, the screaming kids in the background. <laughs> See ya. The bridge there, some bikes just ran over that he was looking at. Bye. Thanks for watching. Check out our merch store down below.